good morning good afternoon good evening whatever time of the day that you're looking at this hello how you doing today well if you are new to this channel i am a new resident in birmingham got so many moves so i did and i will be exploring birmingham through food through the events well probably not the events because it's corona but definitely the food um today on the list i'm gonna cross off santos coffee is downtown birmingham I think they have like a lot of locations but today i'm at the one in downtown birmingham and it's the morning i just want a cup of coffee probably if they got like some little muffin not really want like a heavy breakfast sandwich because i'm not super hungry so i'm just gonna keep it light you know little muffin little coffee what kind of coffee i can get creative today i'm up for anything because usually I get like a white chocolate mocha. I like sugar, okay, in my coffee. That's how I like mine. <laughs> um, but today, so I'm just gonna yeah, just ask, you know, what's what's your best seller? And let's see what it is. And if it's nasty, ooh, it's gonna be nasty. No, I don't want it to be nasty. <laughs> but okay, let's go. so on this portion i am going to do a voiceover i completely forgot about the music playing in the background and i don't want any copyright issues so i'm just going to do a voiceover so here i sat down i had a signature drink it was an ice mint latte and this is the branding of the cup it's cute it's classy i like it it's simple and so i got that latte but i got it hot because it's winter and it's cold outside <laughs> so i asked for something sweet and he was really nice to help me and he had really great customer service so i really enjoyed his service and so i also got a peach muffin i never thought to put peach inside a muffin but here we are you know they put bananas inside a muffin so why not peach and so as you can see i am going in for a bite i'm trying to dig the fork inside i'm giving you a little preview of what it looks like before i, I dig into it the presentation is great on the top it looks like a cinnamon streusel at first that's what i thought it was when i was looking at it through the glass it was a, i thought it was a cinnamon streusel but it was actually peach and so i'm tasting it here i'm liking what i'm seeing and just looking at myself looking at me eat i see that i enjoy it and so i want y'all to see how large it is like i did not eat that all in one sitting i definitely had some left over so if you go you can get that and you can eat a little bit for breakfast and then you can have some like a mid-morning snack or if you just want some in the afternoon you can have the other half late other half later and so i really like that aspect too so you paying for one but you really kind of get two if you don't eat all of it at one time so it was really good i would go back and get it right here i'm thinking like what it could be paired with i am thinking that it could go with a pumpkin like a pumpkin spice latte it would go really well with that like because it was the cinnamon was really powerful so i think that it would go well with a pumpkin spice type of latte or pumpkin creamer in your coffee that would be really good <music> y'all can hear me in the video or not i was trying to say i got an ice well i didn't, didn't I, listen get it right okay there were signature drinks in or on their menu and so one of them was a ice mint latte well i told them you know like i want something sweet i usually get like a white chocolate mocha but out of your signature drinks which one is the sweetest and he said the ice mint latte and i was like, okay well can we do it high? i was like yeah of course so he did it hot and it tastes like it doesn't taste like hot chocolate. It tastes like peppermint syrup and coffee, basically. Um, but it has like a 
Let me taste it. Let me taste it. Mm -hmm. It's like a dark chocolate. Different. It's like the bean. It's like maybe it's not spicy, but it's like you know we not Starbucks. You know we not folders. We Santos. Like that's what they. <laughs> uh, it's good. I come back again. I would give them a at a scale of a ten. I would give them an eight. The customer service was great. He was nice. I like that. Is well, it's connected to a hotel. I didn't know that, but the hotel is nice. So I assume you know it's just like a little add on when you in the hotel you leave and you come down there and get your coffee or whatever um but it's still like separate enough to where it could be its own coffee shop so that was good and it was it was kind of it was kind of busy since it's the morning um so at a scale of one to ten i would give them an eight because the muffin that i got it was good i did not get oh i haven't had a peach like muffin before who would have thought to put peach in the muffin i guess so you put banana in the muffin it's, it's doable so it's good the flavor was good it had a bold flavor i didn't really taste the peach though oh um, i, I would have just thought it was like a cinnamon like streusel it's good it's good but yeah i just didn't really and i maybe i gotta go back and try it again but initially i didn't really taste the peach maybe it's like a little soft note of peach okay <laughs> but it was good um but it could have been a little bit more moist i would say that like it was it wasn't like super dry but it could have been more moist um so for that i'll give them an eight out of ten um but yeah i definitely would be back and coffee was great so i'm about to go on with my day peace